Right, y'all this exercise is called a jump squat so what we're going to do traditional squat and we're adding a jump at the top so there's a couple different ways to do this so our traditional squat form we're bracing the core keeping our feet about hip shoulder width apart everybody's different there so get into a position you're comfortable in and then we're doing that traditional squat squatting down pushing the hips back bracing the core, and then we're simply adding a jump to the top. So squatting down, up and jump. So notice it's not a hard land either. Digging the heels into the ground, up, kind of like a bunny jump. I want toe to heel, nice and gentle here. And you can go at your own pace. So you could really bring it up and down here, or you can bring it almost as two separate motions. Now, if you want to modify this a little bit, bring it to a squat to calf raise where we're going down. And instead of that hop up, then we're just going down and up on the toes. Down and up on the toes. Especially people who have knee injuries, hip, um, any lower body injury, I recommend the squat to calf raise first, and then you can slowly add in that impact.